Hello everyone and a warm welcome back to Kashagaris. This is the place where budding entrepreneurs, business enthusiasts, and seasoned innovators gather to explore, discuss, and delve into the riveting world of business. If you're joining us for the first time, we're absolutely thrilled to have you with us. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to stay informed on our latest content. In today's episode, we are setting out on a captivating journey through the annals of business history, one that traces the story of an organization that redefined commerce and technology in our times, Amazon.com, Inc. We'll witness its extraordinary transformation from a fledgling online bookstore to a towering behemoth of global e-commerce and cloud computing. This journey isn't just a tale of corporate success. It's a playbook of strategies, filled with insights on scaling businesses, innovating continuously, and keeping the customer at the heart of it all. We'll also discuss how you, the entrepreneur, can adapt these strategies to build a business that could compete with Amazon, the challenges you might face, and how to navigate around them. So, let's buckle up for this thrilling exploration, filled with facts, insights, and deep learning. Our story begins in 1994, in a humble garage in Bellevue, Washington. A former Wall Street executive, Jeff Bezos, had a vision. Inspired by the potential of the Internet, he launched Amazon as an online bookstore. But that was just the beginning. Today, Amazon isn't just a bookstore or a retail giant. It has an extensive portfolio of businesses, including cloud computing with Amazon Web Services, entertainment with Amazon Prime Video, consumer electronics with devices like Kindle and Echo, and even space travel with Blue Origin. Let's take a moment to appreciate this mind-boggling metamorphosis. To understand how Amazon achieved this, we need to explore the three pillars that constitute the bedrock of Amazon's strategy, raising capital, constant innovation, and a customer-first approach. Starting a business requires capital, and Amazon's journey is a masterclass in fundraising. The initial capital for Amazon came from Bezos' personal savings and a $1 million investment from his family and friends in 1995. But that was just the seed. The $8 million Series A funding in 1996 from Kleiner Perkins marked the start of institutional interest in Amazon. This capital injection allowed Amazon to scale its operations and increase its book inventory. In 1997, Amazon went public, raising $54 million through its IPO. This was a significant milestone as it not only gave Amazon the financial muscle to fuel its aggressive expansion strategy but also put it on the global map as a legitimate player in the nascent online retail sector. However, raising capital does not come without its challenges. Investors demand returns and this puts pressure on the company to deliver growth and profitability. For instance, Amazon's heavy investment in growth and infrastructure in its early years led to significant losses, which was a cause of concern for its investors. The company did not report a full-year profit until 2003, almost a decade after its founding. If you're aspiring to compete with Amazon, the ability to raise capital effectively is crucial. This isn't just about convincing someone to write you a check. It's about creating a compelling business model showcasing your unique value proposition, and proving that your business has the potential for profitable growth. However, remember that with each round of funding, you'll be giving away a part of your business and will be under pressure to deliver returns. Capital is just the fuel. The engine that propelled Amazon's growth was its commitment to innovation. Amazon understood early that it wasn't enough to just sell books online. It needed to offer something that brick-and-mortar stores couldn't. Amazon's innovations over the years are myriad. From pioneering customer reviews in 1995 to introducing the game-changing, one-click patent in 1999, from launching the Kindle e-reader in 2007 to ushering in the era of voice-activated AI with Alexa in 2014, Amazon has continually rewritten the rules of retail. And who can forget AWS? What started in 2006 as a way for Amazon to sell its excess computing capacity has now become the world's largest cloud computing platform, counting big names like Netflix, Twitch, LinkedIn, and Facebook as customers. 
but with innovation also come potential pitfalls. Amazon's Fire Phone, launched in 2014, is a case in point. Despite the hype and investment, the smartphone failed to capture market interest and was discontinued just a year after its launch. For your venture to compete with Amazon, embracing an innovative mindset is paramount. Constantly observing market trends, understanding customer needs, experimenting with new ideas, and taking calculated risks will be the order of the day. But remember, not all innovations will succeed. The key is to learn from failures, pivot quickly, and keep moving forward. The third pillar of Amazon's success strategy is an unwavering obsession with the customer. Bezos himself said, We see our customers as invited guests to a party, and we are the hosts. This mantra has guided Amazon's approach to business. Whether it's the convenience of home delivery, the vast product selection, personalized recommendations, customer reviews, or the Prime program's fast shipping and added benefits, everything Amazon does aims to enhance the customer experience. However, this customer-centric approach hasn't been without controversy. Allegations of aggressive pricing tactics that undermine small businesses, data privacy concerns, and criticisms about their labor practices have sometimes cast a shadow over their customer-first image. To build a venture that can compete with Amazon, the customer must be your primary focus. Beyond offering great products or services, consider how you can provide exceptional customer experiences. Can you offer personalized experiences? Stellar customer service? Innovative loyalty programs? At the same time, it's crucial to balance customer satisfaction with other stakeholders' needs, your employees, suppliers, and the community at large. Amazon's growth trajectory is one of constant evolution, adaptation, and scale. It's about not just growing the customer base or expanding the product catalog but about scaling various aspects of the business simultaneously. Their logistics network is a testament to this, from relying on traditional delivery services to building a global shipping and delivery network, including drone and robot delivery systems. However, scaling is a complex process fraught with challenges. For instance, managing a global supply chain can be logistically challenging and requires robust systems and processes. As Amazon expanded internationally, it faced, and still faces, various hurdles such as regulatory norms of different countries, cultural differences, and local competition. Amazon also had to continually innovate its technology infrastructure to support its expanding business. This led to the creation of AWS, initially to handle their own infrastructure needs, but it quickly evolved into a massively profitable cloud service provider. In your journey to compete with giants like Amazon, building and scaling your business will require a well-defined strategy, strong operational execution, and a resilient team. You must be prepared to deal with challenges related to logistics, regulations, technology, and human resources. Strategic partnerships can be a helpful way to overcome some of these hurdles. For example, collaborating with local businesses can help you navigate regulatory norms and understand cultural nuances when expanding into new markets. The odyssey of Amazon, from a humble online bookstore to a global e-commerce and cloud computing behemoth, offers an incredible learning opportunity for any entrepreneur. The story is one of vision, strategy, perseverance, and the willingness to take calculated risks. If you plan to build a business that can take on giants like Amazon, remember, it starts with a dream. A dream, followed by a clear vision, a strong strategy, and unwavering commitment to making it a reality. But no journey is without its challenges. Remember, how you respond to these challenges can make the difference between success and failure. Learn from Amazon's journey, understand the strategies they used, the challenges they faced, and how they turned some of these challenges into opportunities. Thank you for joining us on this intriguing journey into the heart of Amazon's business model and strategy. We hope it's been insightful and inspirational. And remember, as we keep saying here at Categories, every giant was once a startup. The key is to dream big, act now, and never stop learning. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your network, 
and subscribe to our channel for more insightful business stories. Until next time, keep dreaming, keep innovating, and keep growing. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to Kashigaris and hit the bell icon for notifications. If there are any other business stories you'd like us to explore, leave us a comment. Stay tuned for our next video, where we continue to explore the exciting world of business. Until then, stay inspired, stay curious, and keep learning.